Welcome guys, PUBG has a problem with its mouse sensitivity because depending on what gun you use, your sensitivity will be different when using the red dot or hollow sight and in some cases also the candid sight. This problem is not something that is happening with all guns, but it happens with quite a lot of them. And so if you ever felt like SMGs felt difficult to aim with compared to assault rifles or pistols for that matter, then this is potentially the reason why. Before I get into the results, I would like to show you guys how I did this test. I had a specific distance across my mouse pad, and then I moved my mouse across that distance. I then looked at the top radar in the game and saw how many degrees my character turned around. And since this problem is something I noticed with the red dot hollow sight, and in some cases the candid sight, I did the test for all of the weapons using all of these sights. I put all of the results in an Excel sheet, and here I have all the different guns, uh, the gun categories, of course, red dot hollow sight, how many degrees I turn in the game across that specific distance I was using, and then I have the same for the candid sight. The places where there is no data is where you can't use either a red dot hollow sight or a candid sight. And what we can see here is that for all the ARs, it is the same sensitivity. So with my specific distance, I moved exactly 180 degrees across that distance. The same was the case for all sniper rifles and DMRs with the exception of the VSS. That when using the candid sight and the VSS, which is still a new thing, my sensitivity was about 14% lower. This is something I've been noticing when I've been trying the candid sight with the VSS, it just feels off. With shotguns and submachine guns, your sensitivity is actually higher when using a red dot or candid sight when you can it's about 10% higher, except the P90, which is 3% lower than the baseline, which is 180 degrees that I found with assault rifles, SRs, and mainly DMRs. When going to the handguns, the sensitivity is 15% higher than what you have with an assault rifle, except when you use the Scorpion, then the Scorpion has the same sensitivity as when using an SMG or shotgun. The crossbow was the one that stood out the most during this test. The crossbow's red dot, and if you put your own red dot or hollow sight on it, will have 16.6% lower sensitivity compared to the baseline assault rifle, meaning that you have to move your mouse a lot more to do the same aiming. And all the LMGs ended up with the same results as the assault rifles. And the best way I found to present this data was to use the baseline 180 degrees I found with all the assault rifles, sniper rifles, most DMRs, and LMGs because then we can see what gun stands out from this baseline. And as this graph shows, submachine guns and shotguns will have higher sensitivity. Pistols will have a lot higher sensitivity. You have lower sensitivity when using the candid sight VSS and also much lower sensitivity when using a crossbow or for that matter, a P90. So why is it like this? Why is the sensitivity different for the different weapons using the different sights? Well, the reason is that the field of view is different. And when the field of view is higher, the sensitivity will be higher. When the field of view is lower, the sensitivity will also be lower because sensitivity and field of view goes hand in hand. And so let me demonstrate this on a training map. Here I have an M4, a VSS and a pistol. All right, so what I told you just before is that the M416 has the baseline sensitivity, so we're all good here. The VSS has a lower sensitivity, and the P18C, which is a pistol, will have a higher sensitivity. So when going ADS with the M4, you will see that the two boxes in front of me just barely touches the edges of the frame, meaning that I can see both boxes within my field of view. With the VSS, my field of view is suddenly lower. You see, I'm further ahead, I'm scoped in more, I'm zoomed in, meaning that right now, since the field of view is lower, the sensitivity will also be lower. The reason, of course, is that the uh, for the VSS, the cannon side is so much forward on the weapon that PUBG had to zoom in in order for this to be close enough to be usable. And with the pistol, the field of view is higher. I can see more of the boxes than I could with the M4, because on the pistol, we don't need to be zoomed in as much as we do on the M4. So that right there is why the sensitivity is different with the different weapons. 
My opinion about this is that in a game like PUBG, which tries everything it can to be competitive, something like this needs to be normalized across all the sites. The sensitivity simply needs to be the same. Otherwise, you will have situations where your sensitivity is higher, like you saw here, or situations where the sensitivity is lower. But what you can do for now is that you can change your sensitivity based on what gun you have to always have the same sensitivity. As an example, if I pick up a VSS, then I have to change my sensitivity from 24 ADS sensitivity to 28 ADS sensitivity in order to have the same sensitivity as when I do use an assault rifle. Of course, this is super silly and I really shouldn't have to do this, but that right now is the workaround if you still want the same sensitivity across the different weapons that you're using. Of course, this is very impractical if you have multiple different weapons that all have different sensitivities and you're not gonna be able to do this. But either way, guys, this might be the reason that you've noticed that some weapons just feels more difficult to aim with than others. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you learned something and I'll see you guys next time.